In this video, B2 Spirit, the most expensive bomber in history explained. Manufacturer, Northrop Grumman Corp. Power plant, four General Electric, F-118 G-100 engines. Payload, 40,000 pounds. Speed, high subsonic. Range, intercontinental. Ceiling, 50,000 feet, 15,240 meters. Armament, conventional or nuclear weapons. Crew, two pilots. The B-2 Spirit, the world's first low observable or stealth strategic bomber, was designed during the Cold War and was modeled after the concepts of revaluationary engineer Jack Northrop. The Air Force did not accept his flying wing design when it initially appeared in 1949 as the YB-49. The B-2 Spirit is a multi-purpose bomber that can carry both nuclear and conventional weapons. Through previously impregnable defenses, the bomber delivers immense firepower to bear anywhere in the world, marking a significant milestone in the U.S. bomber modernization effort. The B-2 offers the penetrating effectiveness and versatility that come with being a manned bomber. It has the rare capacity to breach an adversary's most advanced defenses and pose a danger to its most prized and well-defended targets because of its low observable qualities. Long into the 21st century, it remains a potent deterrence and fighting force due to its capacity to breach air defenses and threaten successful reprisal. With its big payload, great aerodynamic efficiency, and innovative combination of low observable technology, the B-2 offers significant advantages over current bombers. Because of its low observability, it may move more freely at high altitudes, improving the aircraft sensor's field of vision and range. It can go around 6,000 nautical miles 9,600 kilometers without refueling. Reduce radar, acoustic, electromagnetic, optical, and infrared fingerprints all contribute to the B-2's low observability. The advanced defense systems find it challenging to identify, follow, and interact with the B-2 due to these signatures. A lot of the low observability process is still classified, but the B-2's flying wing design, unique coatings, and composite materials all add to its stealthiness. Unlike the B-1B and B-52, which had crews of four and five pilots, respectively, the B-2 has a crew of two pilots, with the mission commander in the right seat and a pilot in the left. On November 22, 1988, the first B-2 was rolled out of its hangar at Air Force Plant 42 in Palmdale, California, for public exhibition. It took off for the first time on July 17, 1989. The engineering, production, and development aircraft on the B-2 are subject to flight testing by the B-2 Combined Test Force, Air Force Flight Test Center, Edwards Air Force Base, California. The B-2's lone operating base is Whiteman AFB in Missouri. Spirit of Missouri, the first aircraft, was delivered on December 17, 1993. Air Force Contractor Support handles depot maintenance for the B-2, which is overseen at the Oklahoma City Air Logistics Center at Tinker AFB, Okla. By flying uninterrupted from its home base in Missouri to Kosovo and back, the B-2 demonstrated its combat effectiveness during Operation Allied Force, killing 33% of all Serbian targets in the first eight weeks. The Chinese embassy in Sarajevo was allegedly damaged by bombs dropped by a B-2 Spirit. The B-2 performed one of its longest flights to date from Whiteman to Afghanistan and back in support of Operation Enduring Freedom. In support of Operation Iraqi Freedom, the B-2 conducted its first combat deployment, unleashing over 1.5 million pounds of ordnance and conducting 27 flights from Whiteman AFB and 22 sorties from a forward operating position. The aircraft received full operational capability status in December 2003. On February 1, 2009, 
The Air Force's newest command, Air Force Global Strike Command, assumed responsibility for the B-2 from Air Combat Command.